And in just about 15 minutes yesterday, I made this video. Breaking news, old people can drive. It's something we've been doing for a long time. And to the one person who told me today to turn in my license, I have one thing to say. You can go f yourself, Greg. It's a super simple combination of two tools, Flux, the new AI imaging tool, and Hydra, a really great AI lip sync tool. And in the next five minutes, I'm gonna walk you through how to do it yourself. It's super simple and you can try it for free. You actually can use this tool to make something weird. Speaking of tools, I guess listen to this guy tell you how to do okay, it. Okay, sure, what she said. Flux from Black Forest Labs is the new AI imaging model that has taken the internet by storm. For this video, we are gonna be using the Flux Realism LoRa. And LoRa is basically a fine tune of an AI image model. This is one of the first ones for Flux. If you've seen those pictures of the TED Talks or of people speaking on stage, most likely they are using the Realism LoRa. So you can install this locally and run it on your computer if you've got a good graphics card. But for this instance, we are going to be using a site called FAL, F-A-L.com. It's another one of these sites like Replicate that allows you to run image models in the cloud. And in this particular instance, we're gonna be running a prompt that was actually created by one of the people that works for FAL, maybe as a founder, Gorkum. Yurtsvin. Sorry, Gorkum, I apologize for mispronouncing your name, but he had been posting some pretty incredible images of women or men hosting news shows. We're gonna go click through to this. It takes you to foul, and it's the Flux Realism Laura up there. And his prompt that he had put in is a charismatic woman is captured mid-speech reporting from a news studio, news program. Behind her is a big sign with the text, man bites dog, studio style lighting, sharp focus. Now again, you can put whatever you want in this prompt. Just to show you how quickly this can be done, I'm just gonna change this. I'm gonna make it like my original prompt. I'm gonna say a charismatic old woman reporting from news studio, behind her, blah, 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 with the text, <laughs> say, uh, Gavin sucks. That's me, I'm Gavin. So I'm just gonna make a, a video which says Gavin sucks. I'm just running it through. You do get some free prompts here. I haven't logged into foul yet. <laughs> okay, so this is pretty good. So here we have a woman that looks a lot like an anchor woman in some form, right? And she's in mid-speech, mid looks pretty realistic. I'm gonna download this. I'm going to a website called Hydra. Hydra is uh, a pretty new AI lip sync tool, but it is very good at making the face move in a realistic way. There's a few downsides, which I'll get into, but for right now, we're gonna try the beta. Now I've logged in and I have a paid account here, but it is free. You can try it for free. So here you have audio. You can either generate audio using their own voices or you can import audio. You have your character, and I'm just gonna upload our image of our character right now that recognizes her face right away. Okay, now for audio, they do have some pretty good voices on here, but I went to Eleven Labs, and I wrote a little quick story, and I wanted to do something specific because it sounds a little bit better, so I'm gonna generate this speech. You can tell it's got- There's a, a story today where we have to tell you that one person has made an image. Okay, I don't wanna spoil it. I'm gonna download it. It's as simple as that, super fast. Eleven Labs, again is a paid tool, but you can use the Hydra in for free. I'm gonna import my audio, grab the 11 labs file, go here, and I'm gonna say generate video. While we're waiting, this is your warning time. <laughs> this is obviously way easier than people expect, and I do believe there's a really important kind of responsibility that people have to make sure that it's clear when you put videos like this out that they are AI. We have generated our video, let's see how this sounds. There is a story today where we have to tell you that one person has made an impact on the world. And it's not good. That's right. Today we're talking about how Gavin freaking sucks. He just sucks so bad. Okay, so you see what that is? You, you can up-res this video and make it look a lot better. I'm not gonna do that right here. That's another video because we're talking about speed. We are literally gonna now just drag and drop this whole package into an editing file. I, I do this in Descript. It's a very simple setup. I just, I'm gonna add the breaking news graphic that you can grab from anywhere. I'm gonna add some breaking news music. And this is the result. There is a story today where we have to tell you that one person has made an impact on the world and it's not good, that's right. Today we're talking about how Gavin freaking sucks. He just sucks so bad. So that's it. It's two tools plus a little bit of editing. 
super fun to try, and you know, it's only going to get better from here. Spend some time and get used to using these tools. The off-the-shelf stuff is pretty amazing right now. If you wanna get into technical stuff, there's a ton more, but this is just a very simple way for the average person to try out these tools very easily right now. If you like this video, please subscribe below, and as always, come back on Thursdays for our podcast. We do a full show about all the AI news and tools every week. Thanks so much, and we'll see you next time.